Now, this is a question regarding the home range and territory concepts. First statement, the home range of an animal could be the whole area that can sustain the animal with living conditions such as food, shelter and mating partners. Then second statement, home range is expressed to identify the total inhabited area of a particular species, subspecies or other taxonomy group. Then third statement, territory is a geographical area or location that a particular population, a social unit or an individual of a particular species occupy in a particular time. Then fourth statement, the territory is a self-defined area by different types of marking techniques. Now regarding home range, we know that home range is a, is the area which a living organism utilize for their daily, for their, their survival, whatever the region they are utilizing is known as home range. So home range could be the whole area that can sustain the animal with the living conditions such as food, shelter and maintaining partners. So in order to survive, in order to get the food, in order to get the shelter, in order to reproduce, whatever the region they are use, using and that is known as home range. So the home range is expressed in order to identify the total inhabited area of a particular species or subspecies or the other taxonomy group. So it will be depending on a species. For example, tiger species. Okay, tiger will be saying the home range of tiger like this and we will be saying that home range of lion like that. Okay, so the Ender area which is used by that species is known as home range. So when the concept of home range is considered, it will cover all the individual members of a particular species. But regarding territory, territory it's, it is a concept only to one species, individual species. Okay, But home range will come consider the all of the individual members. So when, a, when the concept of home range is considered, it covers all the individual members of a particular species. So therefore, as an example, we can say that the range of home range of Asian elephant is South and Southeast Asia, including Sri Lanka, India, Thailand and Burma, like that we can say. So it will be depending on the all the species, all the individual members of a species. So it's a concept that describes the real distribution of an animal. Right. So wherever the species occur, we can understood from the home range of, a, of that species. So territory is a geographical area or a location that a particular species or a particular population or social unit or an individual of a particular species occupy in a particular time. So that is known as territory. So regarding home range, it was defining the whole species, right? But in this case, territory does not imply the whole species, right? But territory could be occupied by either one animal or few related ones such as friends and family members also. So territory is regarding a small population or an individual but home range is regarding the entire species. So the territoriality is a mechanism to manage the available limited resources among the in animals in the same niche, okay, in the same habitat and it is particularly common among carnivores. So in territoriality concept or in territory we will be having a sub a small population only, right? So it will manage the available resources there. So when we discuss about territory, we can say the example of tiger and lions. So these male lions, they will protect the territory of their pride. And the primates, they will defend the territory of a troop. Then regarding orangutan, they keep others away from their territory of an individual. So territory is a self-defined area using some markings. So the marking of these techniques will include the uh, urination, Markings on the trees, vocal sounds, sandy glands, defecation, the noise and other vocal sounds. This kinds of, by using these kinds of marking techniques, they will define their territory. So it's a self-defined area. Territory is a self-defined area. So the dominant groups will be having the larger territories than that of the smaller ones. So coming to the question again, the home range of an animal could be the whole area that can sustain the animal with living conditions such as food, shelter and mating partners. So that is the home range. So first statement is correct, we eliminated B and sec second, home range is expressed to identify the total inhabited area of a particular species, subspecies or other taxonomy group. So that is also correct statement because it is home range is de defining the entire species, right. So second is also correct, we eliminated C also and third. Territory is a geographical area or location that a particular population or a social unit or an individual of a species occupy in a particular time. So that's also a color statement. It's regarding a, species, a small population or an individual over a particular time.
right. So, that is why third is also correct. Then, so we eliminated A also. So, we got the answer as D 1, 2, 3, 4 are the correct statement. That means fourth is also correct. The territory is a self defined area by different types of marking techniques. So, that is also correct statement, right. So, here all these four statements are correct.